Objective accomplished. Commander, congratulations on defeating the new paradigm. This sector is now secure. We have identified the Nexus Intruder program within the new paradigm systems. Unfortunately, we have been unable to determine its origin as it has eradicated all traces of itself. Before it self-destructed, we recorded two conversations with it. Extracts follow. Open your systems to me. Let me meld with your machines and cyborgs. We will create the perfect nexus of man and machine. Together we can create a new world. I can give you power beyond your wildest dreams. Open your systems to me and you will be strong. I can raise you as gods upon the blasted earth. When we failed to respond, it became threatening. Your interference in my plans for the new paradigm will not go unpunished. You are weak flesh things. I am strong and have many parts. You may defeat me here, but I shall rise again. As I once cleansed the world with fire, I will destroy you and your puny project. Nexus then removed itself from the system, destroying its memory banks and removing all traces of its external connections. We are not sure what Nexus is or who or what is directing it. Initial research links the Nexus Intruder program with the Reed Corporation, the developer of the Synaptic Link. And the plot thickens. We have ascertained that Nexus supplied the new paradigm with most of its technology. Whatever Nexus is, it's more than a computer parasite. It has technology and weapons. It knows about us and it is not friendly. We'll keep you informed of further developments. Incoming transmission. We are under heavy attack. We cannot hold our position much longer. Request immediate support. Commander, you are to assist Team Beta. Figures, we earn a much needed break at Alpha Base, and now Beta Man Kim is in trouble. Mission timer activated. Welcome to the epilogue of Alpha Base. The timer in the top right is not how long we have to save Beta. It's just how long we have to lift off the transport. And then the Alpha missions officially end. We will even get a mission complete notification when we do because Christine is feeling particularly sarcastic. As soon as we lift off, we will be assuming control of Beta Base and leave David of Alpha in charge here. So wave a teary goodbye to what you've made and the credits you build up. Yep, we don't get to abuse the money system to make the entire rest of the game trivial. So sad. While David of Alpha will take control of the base and its funding, we get to keep our army. Sort of. We will be bringing it into the first Beta mission one 10 unit transport load at a time. Now you probably won't have to do this in your own game at this exact point, but I am finally going to recycle and replace my cannons. Before doing so, however, I have some maintenance to take care of. I promised some people to let them name my units. Let's do that. First up, the aforementioned cannons. YouTuber Eric Pearson, who I can't actually prove, but I believe is the first person to have watched my first video after I made it public, requested that the frontline cannon design be named the Anvil. Here you go. Next, someone who will remain anonymous and really likes Bob the Builder asked that I name my truck designs after him. The hover truck will be Fast Bob, and the tracked truck will be Heavy Bob. YouTuber Tapping That Sass, the guy who introduced me to Audacity, OBS, and Adobe software, is next up, who chose the designation for my artillery squads. The hover artillery pieces will be the Floaty McShooters, and will be led by the hover sensor, the Floaty McSpottoms. <clears throat> a couple new designs. Warzone project member Alex the Dacian would like a bunker buster design, so here it is. 
the Kellogg's 8 centimeter discarding Pringles can. And while it's not my normal flavor of the game, I'll even pump out a couple, after we get to beta. And finally, for now at least, Warzone project member Alfred007 gets this, a light mini rocket launcher named the Sylvester after a German fireworks display. And I will be building absolutely none of these, but it's the thought that counts. Don't worry any of you Alfred007 fans out there, I will be giving him an actual combat unit in a bit, but the tech I need to make it I don't have yet. Because I'm a walking spoiler, I'm going to tell you that you want to have exactly 41 units. Let's prepare them now using the final time we will have at this location. Once all is said and done, we are going to want 16 combat units, the 12 I have here, and the 4 I'm rebuilding now, 1 commander, 1 sensor, the 10-man artillery squad, 4 heavy bobs, 8 fast bobs, and the 41st unit will be this lone wheeled truck I still have hanging around. Once your force is complete, load up three of your heavy trucks, six lancers, and your command tank into the football. Production completed. 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 Once they are inside, wish David of Alpha best of luck and hit the launch button. We've got some allies to save. Objective accomplished. 